Hello everyone, Adrenaline XL 2025 is here. Today I'm opening up one of the mega packs you can get from the brand new collection. I'm so excited for this one. Mega packs coming in at 14.99 this year, or 14 euros 99. So I think you get a better deal in euros, but only a little bit. So you get yourself a golden baller pack, which you're gonna open right at the end. You're gonna get two spare packs, or two loose packs, and a mini tin as well. So let's get this open and get these packs open. They're a little bit easier to unstick. Thanks, Benini. These have been in the past, been ridiculously hard to unstick, as you've seen in the video. That was a delight. That was so easy to peel off. Thank you, Panini. I don't know if you watch my videos. I hope you do, but I've often complained about that. So thank you. All right, so let's have a look at the, the back. So there's no, these are available on the Panini website, probably in stores as well. We haven't seen the big tins yet, which have a guaranteed gold and border pack in. Hopefully they come out soon. Maybe they're delaying them because they don't want people getting gold and waters too soon. That might be why, actually. Um, as far as I know, everything else on here is available to purchase. We've got two limited editions, actually. Could be an excellence. I'm not sure if you can get signature ones in there, but those are some of the limited editions you get. You should be able to, should be able to. I'm gonna start off with the loose ones first of all, then we'll get into the rest of them. So have a look at the odds. So we've got Crest of one in three. Uh, the rarest cards, obviously. The trophy is one in 55 packs. Last year it was not rare at all. I've got three. In the kickoff packs, I think. Invincible, one in 25, that's a lie. Golden Ball is one in 25, probably. There's about eight or nine of them, I think. Invincible, one in 25, it's not gonna be one in 25 packs. I promise you that. Unless you get a full box, you might get lucky. Uh, apart from that, the other rare ones, Relentless. Ice, High Flyers are one in 20. Precision, one in 24. So those are also really rare. And big thing to point out, eight cards per pack, which is absolutely amazing. On the front of this one, Anthony Gordon, Cold, Palmer, Son, Kudos, and Fernandez on the front of this one. So let's have a look. We've got Kurt Zuma, Kurt Zuma for West Ham. I think he's left. I think I heard he left or he's leaving. Stadiums are here as well now. Vitality Stadium for Bournemouth. I love that. I've got these in there. And then we've got Midfield Master of Enzo Fernandez. They are reusing this design. They use it every year. I love it. They reuse this design again. They can use every single set for all I care. I love this one. The kind of diamond kind of effect. Then we've got Zabanyi Defensive Hero for Bournemouth. And the code is there for some reason, so scan that. We've got Tom Kearney, Max Kilman for Wolves. I think he's left as well. Jefferson Lerma and Aged for West Ham. On to our second pack. A second loose pack. We've got Neto for Bournemouth. Not a Bournemouth so far. Something shiny there. I don't think it's a very rare card. We've got Yon Visa for Brentford. Bassi, powerhouse for Fulham. Hot shot Ivan Tony. That's nice. It's kind of like a Super Saiyan effect. Why? Wow, that's pretty cool. Ivan Tony. I don't think he'll still be at Brentford by the end of the transfer window, but I think they've had an injury to their other players, so he might stay. And again, the code is there for some reason. That might annoy me, to be honest. But there's the code. Nathan Ake. Caicedo for Chelsea and Ciso for Brighton disappeared last season after a really good breakout year. Hopefully he comes back again this year. And Canate for Liverpool. So we're going to leave the golden baller to the end. We're going to move on to our pocket. And you get five packs inside, two limited editions. Could be a special excellence or signature card. So I'm guessing read autographs are possible as well. One online coin card, which I don't think I've ever used, to be honest. And there's four different tins to collect. We have the orange and blue one. And as far as I know, there's no mega tin or the big tins that are available yet. Now these can be hard to open. Let's see. All right, I have to open it off camera, to be honest. But we got there. All right, gonna get them out. Oh, we might, ooh, where, hang on. What is that? We might have an excellent, if I remember correctly, Excellence cards do come in like that, don't they? And why is that like that? I'm gonna get a tin over here because it messes up the lighting, which I found out way later than I should have that it messes up the lighting. What is that one? So I think, oh, that's the coin card, of course. Well, yeah, I don't know what I'll do with that. All right, so I'm pretty sure we've got, a, I'm pretty sure we've got an excellence. So we've won. Well done. We have one. Excellence card. 
in this one. Limited edition. Could be a signature or printed autograph in here. Or a real autograph in here. So that would be really nice. Let us get through the basic packs first of all. We could get a golden border in here as well. Which would be amazing. Or maybe even the trophy, which is technically the rarest card, actually. Even rarer than the Invincible, according to their own pack odds. All right, Hypersonic Mavadidi. Super Stopper, Jordan Pickford. Got a Wolves Defender. Craig Dawson, Model Pro. Anfield, Liverpool Stadium. Mikalenko. Jack Taylor for Ipswich. We've got Leicester Forward. Is it Jamie Vardy? No, it's Patson Dacker. When you think of Leicester Forward, you think Jamie Vardy, no one else. There's Chris Richards for Palace. Okay, on to our next one. It'd be great to get a golden baller from one of these in normal packs. So there's the next code. And then I'm going to flip the. Oh, with a nice adrenaline rush of the Bruyne. There's no shiny effect. Oh, there is kind of. I think in the last one, in the plus one, it was kind of like a black and white kind of one, which is oh, okay. I think I prefer the last one to this one though. That's that's still quite cool. Ice of Eze for Palace. They've reused this diamond design. I like it. But they have reused on two now. There's Eze Ice. Really nice card though. Willock for Newcastle. I've got to talk about the design on these. Basic but nice. I like it. It's I think I like it. I prefer it when they keep it really simple. This is quite simple for the base cards. And obviously the flavour behind them of the, the team kit colours. Pretty cool. Gobez for Wolves. What Raheem Sterling for Chelsea. I don't know why there's red in the Chelsea one. I don't think any part of their kit has a red on it. There's Declan Rice. Purple. Is that purple? Purple for Arsenal. Alright, there's a little bit of a criticism. <laughs> there's no purple at all in the Arsenal kit. Let me finish off with Lewis Cook for Bournemouth. I might end with the excellence card, actually, instead of the golden border. So there is the code for that one. Off center, if you're into your grading. Ivan Tony Hotshot, I think my first double of the video. Nice card, though. And Midfield Master, they've reused this diamond one now. This is the third design that has the diamond effect. I like it, but I, I, I'd rather they didn't overuse it. It's not in every design. Not bad, though. Wangi Chan for Wolves. Walker Peters, Kovacic, and these are going to be this way. Ethan Pinnock, Brentford, Gagpo for Liverpool, and Tommy Asu for Arsenal. All right. Can we get a golden baller in one of these? There's the code. Brentford badge. These are a little bit rare from memory. Shea Charles for Southampton. Mark Garhi. And then these are all... We've got to get used to every season. I've got to get used to that. Tommy Doyle Wolves, Jota, Lascelles, Kulisevsky for Spurs. Oh, that's nice. I like that. That's a very good design. Breakthrough, Adam Wharton. That's nice, actually. You'd expect to see that kind of design in like a more premium set. That's actually really, really nice. Yeah, well done, Panini, on that breakthrough design. Really, really nice. There is, I think, the last code of the video. And we've got a Wolves badge. Oh, oh, these are rare, aren't they? Relentless Connor Gallagher, who I think has officially left for Madrid. Oh, one in 16 for Relentless. So these are a little bit rare. One of the rarer cards to get. Connor Gallagher, Relentless. It's a shame that a lot of these are going to be out of date because the transfer window isn't even closed yet. Liverpool haven't made a single signing at the time of this video being recorded. So I expect to see some more cards for Liverpool. In XL Plus. And then we've got Robinson for Wol uh, Fulham, Flecken, and Billy Gilmore for Brighton. So I totally lied to you all. I'm going to open the Golden Baller pack next. And then the limited editions afterwards. So, alright, I spoiled that a little bit. Hopefully you didn't see who that was, because I did. It is. Alright. I don't know yet. For those who don't know, build up some tension. 2025, that's the difference they have from the last one. They didn't have that on the back. I guess it's the only way to differentiate them from the other ones. But there is our first golden baller on the channel. Cole Palmer, a.k.a. Cold Palmer. Great Euros for England. It should have started every game, to be honest. He was so good. But there he is, Cole Palmer for Chelsea. Our first golden baller on the channel. There could be a signature in here or a real autograph. 
but we both know, or we all know, there probably isn't. So I'm going to leave the excellence card to the end. That's going to be doing good. And I'm going to open up a limited edition card. I don't even know who has autographs in these yet. It's so new to me. I haven't checked the checklist. As you all know, I haven't even opened the starter pack yet. So let's see who we get here. It is Tyrone Mings, a limited edition. I like the frame kind of design. That's pretty cool. But it's not a signature or a printed autograph. On to the main event of the video. Didn't expect to get this. It is an excellence card. I'm guessing it's going to be this way as well. Again, I have no idea what excellence cards there are. It's this way. It is Brentford midfielder, left winger, striker, which is probably Johan Visa, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, Johan Visa, excellent. Oh, that's nice. It's kind of like a super fractal kind of design with tops. That's pretty cool. Are these numbered? It looks like it should be numbered. That's really, really nice. That is really nice. Hopefully it comes out on the video. In terms of the excellence card, I think that is better than the last one. Really, really nice looking card though. Yo and Visa, excellent. That's it for this video. The first video on the channel for Adrenaline XL 2025. I really hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to like and subscribe if you did. And I'll see you next time.